What do I have when I have nothing? I think the answer is everything. I flow gently, like wilderness returning, lifting through the tarmac to reveal an ancient way. I do not know this path until I realize I am on it. I have been walking all this time. I wonder as I wonder, I think. I think I am only speculating, but really I am traveling. Old gods blow their horns. The crowned kings tremble and rise from forgotten graves. Tourism crumbles, hotels collapse. An old horned god lifts his neck and howls, shattering maps and signposts. As the fiction burns, it is clear I am mating with goats and ghosts and rocks. Breaking my teeth as I devour red rusted contours, blood pouring from my nose and ears and eyes, spilling out from my heart as I am infested with the great nations of flower and insect. My flesh falling apart like tender meat loose from the bone, laying courses of water that flood the dusty cups of silent sliding silver and uncountable days. The people are terrified and so they call it grab and snatch at fat and plastic and bullshit to cloud them. They cling and become creating new bodies, the armor of lostness, keeping the raging beauty, the horror of now, hidden, concealed. They walk with flip-flops past the pharmacy and into the bar again and again and again. I watch them, bound and gagged, a hundred smooth stones holding me down. I peep through the crack from the cavern that swallows me in the dark, in the dust, in the musk of the shit from the guts of narrow-eyed beasts whose bells ring the prayers of my forgotten song, echoing out until my fingertips pulse and throb and I scratch and claw then at the jagged rocks, ripping my skin down to the bone. The furry ones lap my blood. I close my eyes. The ones with teeth begin to gnaw on my exposed knuckle bones. I breathe out. And the flowers steal my breath. The buzz of winged legs cluster. Hundreds, thousands, sucking my salt and twisting it into the honey of larvae that burrow deep into my marrow. I lay and extend, anchored fully in the cracked ravines and exalted mountain arcs, blistering in leaves and bushes, cut down to build another resort. My blood boils and burns, liquid rock heated by the furnace of an ancient star. I will pack this in a clever way, neatly folded into the box and leave it on the beach. The child that opens it will find a pearl. <laughs>